Nighttime skies over Oriole Park in Baltimore. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Washington Nationals and the Texas Rangers. It'll be fun watching these two swing it all series long. First pitch is next. Michael Taylor is at the plate here as he quickly finds himself down a strike. It's 0-1. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Helping him out here as he swings and misses to fall behind a ball and two strikes. Oh, and he sure got a good one, doesn't he? That ball goes from about knee high to ankle high in the matter of about five feet. Swung on, and he went fishing in the dirt. And he makes the throw to first. Taylor is retired, and there's one away. Now to the plate, Anthony Rendon, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And a bouncing ball, foul. Bases are empty, one man out. Swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. Holland sets his sights, 0-2 on its way. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. And he'll take it onto the bag himself. Two gone now here in the first. Bryce Harper gets his first opportunity now in the top of the first with nobody on. First pitch coming. Here it is. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And boy, big problems here to start this at bat. It's 0-2 now. And you kind of get the sense that he's not really messing around out there too much. There hasn't been a whole lot of setting guys up here in this inning. And he will get there to make the running play, and that will... Delino DeShields comes to the plate. Delino. I had him lunging at that one out of the zone, and that's strike one. A shot down the first baseline. He'll take it to the bag himself, and the leadoff man is gone here to start the home first. Number 30 steps in. He'll get his first shot at it here. And a high strike there, 0-1. That first pitch is going to be key all night long. If he gets ahead early with the fastball, that's when he can get tough to figure out, especially with the arsenal that he has. On the ground to the left side. Rendon is there. Throw gets him. Two down. Prince Fielder gets his first cuts now. The bases are empty, and there are two away here in the opening frame. Yeah, and nothing doing so far here. He kind of needs to put up a tough at-bat right here just to make this guy work a little bit. Oh, and a big hack by Fielder, just like his daddy, but it's 0-2. Yeah, you've got a cold night. The ball won't be carrying as well. So you can afford to take a few more chances in the strike zone and challenge. And the throw is in time to get him to retire the side. Ryan Zimmerman makes his way to the plate. He'll get us started here in the top of the second. Holland has his sign. First pitch on the way. And he'll start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. On the ground to the right side. A door is there. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Stepping in, Daniel Murphy. He'll get to take his first cuts here. And a check swing here, but he clearly went around on a pitch that would have been a strike anyway. It's nothing in one. Sinker, one ball, one strike. Gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Ready to deliver the one and two. Gets a small piece near the plate. Holiday is up with it. Throw on to first, and Holland looks to be in control here. Two away now. Jason Wirt into the box here in the top of the second, looking to keep this inning going. They'll try and entice him with a high fastball, but he wouldn't commit. It's ball one. That evens it up one and one. Oh, 
And he comes up empty there on a pitch in the dirt and falls behind now one and two. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. To short. A barehand play by Andrus. It's there. He got him. Wow. Made him look. Adrian Beltre strides into the box now to lead Leading off the, the home Rangers. half of the second inning. Third baseman, Adrian Beltre. And here is strike one call to the 37-year-old veteran up there. Nothing and one. You know, on May 15, 2015, Adrian Beltre oh. became the 52nd Damn. player in MLB history to hit 400 home runs. He's in some pretty remarkable company. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. And taken in out there for the first out. Mitch Moreland digs in here for his first appearance. Into the windup and the pitch. He'll start him with a breaking ball. Too low that time. It's ball one. Now a fastball for a called strike. It's one and one. Pulls this one into the air out into right field. Harper back in plenty of time to put this away, however, and there are two gone. Ian Desmond gets his first chance here, looking to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Right there for strike one. Still looking for our first hit in the ballgame. Good curveball. Strike two. And that will end the inning. Chris Heisey leads it off here. Bottom third of the order Lead set to go the here in the third. Well, he's faced the minimum so far, Chris and obviously Heisey. it's still early, but they need to get something going because you can't let this guy settle in out there. Holland's ready. 0-1 pitch on its way. And now a curveball as he's got to lean out of the way. That one nearly got him. Ground ball right side. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Danny Espinosa ready to take Danny his first cuts here. Danny Espinosa ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Now a ground ball for Andrus at short. This could be two. On the fielder, and they turn to a double play. Wilson Ramos digs in with his team still looking Wilson at a zero in the Ramos. hit column. Yeah, they just haven't been able to figure it out yet, but it's still early. We're seeing some pretty good pitching so far in this game. Good hard slider there, but it runs away. It's a ball and a strike. And that's on the outside corner. One and two. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate. And he'll have another shot at it here. The one and two pitch. And another foul ball. One and two, here it comes. Lifted out towards straightaway center field. DeShields is there, and that retires the side. Rukna Dodor digs into the box in the bottom Leading of inning number Rangers. three. Ready with the first Second pitch, baseline. here it comes. Ned and he'll power in a fastball that time at 94 for strike one. You like what you've seen from this guy so far? I do. I, I like where he's putting the fastball, and I like the movement he's been getting on both his curveball and changeup. I think he'll do well. And he'll fall behind now to one and two. Able to protect the plate with two strikes, and he'll see another one. A ball and two strikes. Here's the pitch. Out in front of that one. May have been looking fastball. Good job just to make contact. Grounded to short. Espinosa's there. The throw is low, and he can't make the pick. 
Elvis Andrews steps in now. First offering on its way. And he starts the number eight hitter with a strike. Nothing in one. Oh, that one got the pitcher. Ah, but they will still get the lead runner at second, so no double play. But, boy, very fortunate to record the first out there. First pitch of the at-bat. Behind on that one, now behind in the count, 0-1. Runners on the move for second. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. And it'll be too late to get Andrus as he's safe at second base. Set to deliver on nothing in two. Here it comes. A big uppercut there as he popped this straight up. Rendon is there for it. Makes the play. And there are two gone now. Coming to the plate now. Delino DeShields. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. One and one. Ah, uh, that thing's knee high on the outside third of the plate. Pretty understandable why he couldn't catch up with that one. Pulled high in the air out to left field. After it is worth. And that's the third out. Michael Taylor will dig in for a second time. A strikeout victim opening up the ball game. Holland into his motion. First pitch on its way. Taylor Saws him off here as this ball's popped into the air. And he'll steer clear of the flying debris to make the catch here for the first down. Anthony Rendon stands in. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out. Well, I think it was a sinker that he rolled over last time up. And he's probably going to see that same pitch again. You got to wait for a mistake up in the zone against a guy like this. Liner toward right center. Solid base hit for him, his first of the afternoon. So a runner on first with one out now, and that'll bring in a dangerous hitter indeed in the form of Bryce Harper. First pitch on its way. And easy to read the thought process here as he starts him out with a sinker below the knees, and it's 1-0. and In tight with the sinker, ball two. Got a very undisciplined swing there. It's two and one. And now he's made most of the hitters inside conscious. And of course, that opens up the outside corner when he has to go there. Won't go after the two one sinker and it's three balls in his strike now. Well, this is a good fastball spot for him now and it's definitely a Fastball swing there, but a good time for the changeup. It's full three and two. Good bite to that sinker as he gets him to swing through it for out number two. Striding into the box, Ryan Zimmerman. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. In there at the knees, strike one. And this one gets away. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away as that'll be scored a wild pitch. One one pitch is a knuckle curve. He's in the hole now one and two. Tap foul at home plate. to two balls and two strikes now. Chop foul at the plate and the count holds it two and two. Has to be thinking strikeout here. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. And he does have a base open, so he doesn't have to give in on three and two. Good battle. Count remains full. He's set. Here's the three and two. Hit out towards second. Odor has it. 
Throw to Fielder at first will take care of him, and that'll be that. Number 30 will dig in. 0 for 1 here in this one. The Ranger fourth, right fielder, number 30. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Got him. Three. Prince Fielder stands in. He's 0 for First 1 after grounding out. Prince Fielder. He'll start him here with a changeup, but it's taken for ball one. Fastball in there for a strike. 92 on the radar gun that time. Pulled toward right center field. Taylor moves over. Two down. Adrian Beltre is into the box for his second at-bat. He popped out into foul territory his first time up. Yeah, and I can guarantee you he wanted that swing back, too. He got a fastball to hit, and it seemed like he put a good swing on it, but he just missed it. Chopped weakly to the left. Espinosa's up with it. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Daniel Murphy heads for the box to start off the fifth in this one. Well, they still don't have any runs on the board yet, so getting this leadoff man on base would be huge. Yeah! Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. Well, he's thrown a first pitch strike to about 60% of the batters he's faced, so that's a pretty good percentage because we're into the middle innings right now. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. A weak chopper up the line. Beltre is right there, and the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. One gone for the Nationals in the fifth, and here's the left fielder, Jason Worth. Chopped in front of home plate. Holiday has it. Throw on to fielder for out number two. Chris Heisey, the hitter now. 0 for 1 on the day after reaching on an error his first time up. Yeah, still looking for his first hit of the game, so let's see if he can come through with that one right here. And this is just off the outside corner for a ball 1 and 0. A little bouncer. That's a foul ball. Outside, two and one. Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. And he'll get under it to put it away in foul territory, and that ends the inning. Mitch Moreland comes to the plate as we get started here in the bottom of the fifth. Well, they still aren't even on the board yet, so this leadoff guy needs to get on so they can manufacture a run. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. Barely able to make contact. Down 0-2 now. High pop-up. Calling for it. Murphy looks it into his glove. And there's one gone. Ian Desmond is into the box. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, and he went down in flames, too. Got him on just three pitches. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Gonzalez gets the sign. Here's the 0-1. Oh, he breaks off a beauty there. Nothing in two now. And he got him. Rugnit Odor stands in. Now batting, second baseman, Ruth Ned Odor. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. High in the air and deep to left center field. Taylor ranging back. And what a play. A beautiful jumping catch to put an end to the inning. Danny Espinoza makes his way to the box to lead us off in the sixth the inning. Absolutely Short nothing stop. going on in this Danny game so far, Espinoza. so we'll see if the leadoff man can oh. get something going. First pitch of the inning is taken low and away for a ball. It's 1-0. Oh. Oh. 
Pitch swung on and hit in the air. On the move is DeShields. He gets there and makes the play for the first down. Wilson Ramos is into the box for his second appearance. 0 for 1 with a fly out. Smoked on the ground up the middle. And that'll find its way into center field for a one out hit. Michael Taylor will stand in. He struck out and popped out in two trips. Well, not a great start at the play. We'll see if he can get something to drive right here. Holland pauses. Here's the delivery. And he's no doubt searching for a ground ball here as this sinker dips below the knees. It's 1-0. Pitch on the inside. Side part of the plate ties him up, and it's 1-1. One and one. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Can't keep the weight back, and he falls behind 1-2. and two. Trying to strike him out for the second time. Here's a high pop-up. Holiday waits on it, and he makes the catch for the second out. Anthony Rendon will dig in. One for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. And this pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. And this one gets away. But fortunately here, no advance. And here's a slider that runs inside that time, and that'll keep him from diving out over the plate. I think he was trying to get that slider in on his hands, but I don't think he meant for it to get in that far. I think he just released it a little too late. Hard sinker misses two and two. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. Tapped out in front of home. Throw on to fielders in time, and with that, the side is retired. Elvis Andrews gets things started here in the sixth for the hometown team. And some action out in that Washington bullpen now as we see both a left-hander and a right-hander throwing. Drilled right back up the middle. And that's a base hit. So a little first pitch swing in there as he's on to kick off the inning. Brian Holiday in now. Hopped out in his first trip. Yeah, he just uppercut a fastball. That top hand kind of dragged through the zone, which caused the bat head to drop a little bit. Sacrifice attempt here. And he is in there. Delino DeShields will step in now. He's bounced out and flown out in his first two plate appearances. Runs up to Bun here, but he missed it for strike one. And here's a swing and a miss as he falls behind nothing in two. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Number 30 will dig in. 0 for 2 thus far. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one and it's strike one. And he watches a called strike at the knees. No balls and two strikes. And a fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Prince Fielder strides in now, and we'll see if he can come through with two on and two out here in the sixth. And he takes a pitch that's ruled a strike at the knees. Pretty liberal strike zone there. It's 0-1. Shoots this one to first, and this continues right on through him as he couldn't knock it down. And they're going to take a 1-0 lead as the run comes across to score. Adrian Beltre will dig in for a third time now. He's popped out and grounded out so far. In there, no balls and a strike. Fastball, and he's quickly in the hole, 0-2. A little late on the fastball, but he's able to spoil that one off, and he'll get another chance. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him. Bryce Harper will stand in here to start the seventh in a game that's been sailing along to this point. Yeah, good thing we don't get paid by the hour, man. This game has flown by. 
pulls the string on that one. One strike. Now here's a ball hit in the air to straightaway right field. This ball's got plenty of carry to it, and it is out of here. Up next for the Nationals, first baseman. A solo home run off the bat of Bryce Harper. And as a result, the Nationals are back even at one run apiece. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. Into the windup, here comes the 0-1. Chop foul right at home plate. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Daniel Murphy will stand in again. A couple of ground outs for him on the ledger in his two trips so far. Yeah, just sort of rolling over on it, guys. See if he can make a small adjustment and get through one here. The 0-1 on its way. Just a bit late, and he's fallen behind 0-2. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. Slider, good two strike pitch, but it misses one and two. Sent on the ground out to second, fielded by a door. Throw gets him two down. Jason Worth will stride forward now. He's bounced out a couple of times already here in the ball game. Just a little off on his earlier swings, guys. You've got to keep that top hand palm up through contact to keep him rolling over. The windup and the 0-1. Sinker, and this one's over as well. Nothing in two now. And this has been a pretty good comeback from that leadoff home run. Two straight outs now, and two strikes here as well. And they'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's one and two. This is line to left. A screaming base hit here, his first of the night. Now at the plate, Chris Heisey. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. And he popped up a high fastball last time, so maybe they feel like they can beat him upstairs. We might see that same pitch again in this at bat. Drops in a strike to start the at bat. Nothing in one. Very weakly on the ground. That goes foul. Two strikes on him now. A pause, and the 0-2. Protecting on 0-2, so we'll do it again. Here comes the nothing and two pitch. Grounded to third. Beltre's there. Here's a flip to Odor covering, and the inning is over. Mitch Moreland steps into the box as the leadoff hitter here in the bottom of the seventh. Designated hitter. And, oh, looked inside, but that's ruled a strike. Nothing in one. Slap hard the opposite way. And that's going to be a base hit. So the possible go-ahead run is on here to start the home half of the seventh. Ian Desmond will dig in. Took a cold third strike his last time. There's a strike at the knees, 0-1. Right over the top with that curveball, and it's 0-2. Swung on and chopped to first. Fielded cleanly by Zimmerman. Espinoza. At the plate, Rugnet Odor. He flew out in his last at-bat. Second baseman, Rugnet Odor. Breaking ball for a strike, 0-1. That misses wide. One ball and one strike. Before the delivery, a check on that go-ahead run at first. And a dive, but he's back in there. Simple throw over there. Keeping one it ball. down here as it's to one and two. Pitch popped up. Rendon able to put it away, and that's out number two. At the plate, Elvin. There's a first pitch curve. trying to come back to the outside corner didn't get it that time it's ball one that's inside two and oh on the move is Desmond pitches a cold strike the throw and he is out at second caught stealing to end 
Danny Espinoza comes to the plate, and he'll start us off in the eighth. Shortstop, Danny Espinosa. And a sinker dips too low there. Into the dirt, in fact. A little late that time as he swings and misses for strike one. And he goes and chops this one out towards second. Odor over to his left. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Wilson Ramos will come forward now. He has flied out and singled so far. Hit hard on the ground to the right. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Michael Taylor will stand in, and they've done a good job keeping him off base at the top of the lineup. He's 0 for 3 thus far. Yeah, guys, not really providing the spark that they usually hope to get out of him. Maybe he can make something happen right here. And that misses for ball one. Drill down the line. And a reach with the backhand, but he comes up empty as that gets by him. And with that, the go-ahead runs up to second now with only one away. Sam Dyson will come on and try to get out of this mess here as there are two on with only one away. Some movement now in that Texas bullpen as a left-hander starts to get cranking down there. Anthony Rendon comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Pretty cool right there. You know, it's so important in a tough spot to get that first pitch strike over. And he's able to jump ahead. Down and away, ball one. Fastball runs in tight here, and it's two and one. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. He knows a drill out there. You got to make him swing the bat to not be giving up walks at this stage of the game because those could be fatal. Thirty-four. Bryce Harper. Here's the first pitch to him. In the dirt and block behind the plate. No movement on base. It's ball one. Who pulled the string and had him way out in front. A ball and a strike. It's going to take a lot of guile to work out of this one. Well, he's got plenty in reserve. This would need to be a magic act, no doubt. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Chops it foul at home plate as the count moves to two and two now. Still two and two. One run, six hits, and no errors so far for the Nationals. Hit hard on the ground towards second. And that is just past his outstretched glove, and that ought to be a base hit. One run scores. And the run is in to score from second. It's now 3-1. to one. Now Ryan Zimmerman will stand in now, hoping to get on track Zimmerman. as they've been able to neutralize his power out of the cleanup spot. 0 for 3 thus far. Well, guys, it just hasn't been his day. You know, sometimes cleanup hit him a bit there as it's fouled at the plate. That misses one and two. And this is going back to the pattern he's been using here lately. Set him up inside and then get him out with pitches away. Chop foul at the plate and we'll do it again. And he struck him out. Good pitch there as he registers his eighth punch out of the ball game. Delino De Shields will stand in as they're quickly down to their final four outs tonight. And Matt, they'd like nothing more than to ignite a two-out rally right here. Maybe scratch at least one across before the ninth. Ooh. 
for short, hit hard. Espinoza fields it cleanly. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Number 43 is on, and he'll take over on the mound. Number Striding in to start the ninth, Daniel Murphy, as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. And so far in this ballgame, he hasn't even been on base yet, so we'll see if he can make an adjustment here. Desmond is there, and it's a picture-perfect beginning to the ninth inning for a pitcher. One pitch, one away. Jason Worth. Jason Worth gets another crack right here. He's got a hit in three tries to this point. And they go right after him on the inside corner for strike one. Hit pretty well out to deep left field. Desmond looks up. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. The batter, the designated hitter, Chris Heising. A solo home run for Jason Worth. As the Nationals move in front now 4-1. to one. Chris Heise is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. The 0-1 pitch. And that's inside off the plate with the fastball. It's 1-1. One and one. one and two now is that one. To short, hit hard. Espinoza fields it cleanly. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Number 43 is on, and he'll take over on the mound. Number Striding in to start the ninth, Daniel Murphy, as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. And so far in this ballgame, he hasn't even been on base yet, so we'll see if he can make an adjustment here. Desmond is there, and it's a picture-perfect beginning to the ninth inning for a pitcher. One pitch, one away. Jason Worth. Jason Worth gets another crack right here. He's got a hit in three tries to this point. And they go right after him on the inside corner for strike one. Hit pretty well out to deep left field. Desmond looks up. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. The batter, the designated hitter, Chris Heise. A solo home run for Jason Worth. As the Nationals move in front now 4-1. to one. Chris Heise is next as he finds himself behind 0-1. The 0-1 pitch. And that's inside off the plate with the fastball. It's 1-1. One one. one and two now as that one's fouled off. And a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at two and two. To third, fielded by Beltre. In time to first, and there are two away. Danny Espinoza strides in, grounded out his last time through. There's a good fastball on the outside corner as you'll take a look at strike one. A little quick on that swing and he finds himself behind 0-2. Swing and a miss and that ends the inning. Your attention please. Now Ninth inning save situation, and they'll Number turn it over to one of the best in the business, Jonathan the all-star Jonathan Papelbon. Swing and a liner, but this is a foul ball. Papelbon's ready. Here it is on 0-1. Boy, in a perfect spot for the splitter there. It's 0-2. Struck him out as his woes continue as that's his third strikeout of the game. First baseman, number 84. Lifted in the air to right field. On the move is Harper, and he tracks it down. A nice running play to record the second out. Adrian Beltre makes his way to the plate, needing to make something happen. They're down to their final out in the ninth inning. A splitter gloved by Murphy. Throw on to first, and the ball game is over.
And guys, we were treated to an excellent pitching performance in this one by the gentleman you see right here. Broadcasting live from Oriole Park at Camden Yards here in Charm City. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the St. Louis Cardinals and the San Francisco Giants. Two of the best bats in the business go at it next on the show. Matt Carpenter is in to start things off here as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. Line hard toward right center. That gets down, and he's got himself a base hit. Number 41 in stands in for the first time. Left fielder, number 41. A fastball one, off the plate away. It's ball one. That'll be a souvenir, and the count will move to one and one. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Drilled right back up the middle. And that's into center field for another base hit. And trouble's brewing here to start the ball game. Matt Holliday steps up to the plate with a great chance to drive in a run here in the early going. And you know, you hear it all the time, but scoring first really is a big deal in this game. Statistically, your chance of winning the game goes up quite a bit when you score first. So this is a big opportunity right now. Now a swing and a fly ball. Pence sprinting after it. And no shot for Pence. This is going to land foul. And another foul ball. for one out of the zone and misses rather badly for the first out. 
Coming to the plate now, Stephen Piscotti. And he could give his guys an early lead if he can come through here. Oh, and it's so important to take advantage of these kind of opportunities early in a ball game. It can change the entire complexion of the game if you can put the other guys on their heels right away. Fastball got him to swing through it. It's one and one. Left field and deep. Back goes Pagan. Gone. A fence scraper, but still good for three runs. Center fielder, Randall Richards. So a three-run blast to straightaway left. And the Cardinals lead it now three to nothing. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. And on 0-2. I'd be shocked to see another fastball in the strike zone. And a swing and a miss as they caught him reaching that time, and there are two away. Now to the plate, Yadier Molina, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at-bat. It's ball one. Lifted in the air out towards left center. Span is under it. And the inning is over. Denard Spann comes to the plate to lead things off here in the bottom Leading half the of the Giants. first. Center fielder, Denard Spann. I uh, couldn't hold up on the curveball there as he went around for strike one. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Grichik calls for it. One out. In now, Joe Pennant. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Drops in a strike to start the at-bat. Nothing and one. Just a bit late, and he's fallen behind 0-2. Not in front of that one, but he stays alive and will do it again on 0-2. Liner towards second. A screaming base hit here, his first of the night. Buster Posey takes his first shot here with the runner at first now and one away. And a ball, 1-0. Oh, oh, he wanted, wanted that one. Probably should have got it, too. This one's a strike. It's 1-1. One one. On the ground, up the middle to second for one. Relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. Colton Wong makes his way to the plate. He'll get us started here in the top of the second. And they jumped out to that early lead, so now it's all about just adding on. Try to bunt his way on base here, but this will roll foul. Fastball misses inside, it's even at one. Swing and he pops him up over toward foul territory. A quick out number one. Number 36 settles into the box for his first chance. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. One and oh. Oh, tough to catch up when it's moving like that. And not a real good cut at that slider, and he's behind one and two. Oh, don't know how you lay off that one, but he did, and it's two and two. Now a swing and a miss. He struck him out, and it's two up, two down to start the second. Michael Walker digs in here for his first appearance. Michael Walker in there at the knees, strike one. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. Right side, fielded cleanly by Belt. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Hunter Pence.
strides into the box now to lead off the home half of the second inning. Right fielder, Hunter. First pitch is a cutter looked at 0 1. And here's a swing and a miss that time by Pence as he falls behind here, nothing and two. Down and away, it's a ball and two strikes. Waka's ready. Here it is on a ball and two strikes. No yeah. offer that time, and it's back to two and two on the Giants' right fielder. Chop foul over towards the dugout. Trying to nibble here, and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. This is in the air out to right field. And this will be pulled in just in front of the warning track for the first out. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And standing in now, the left-handed hitting first baseman, Brandon Belt. There's a strike at the knees, 0-1. Fastball, and he's quickly in the hole, 0-2. He's just working east and west here. He'll be fine if he just stays out of the middle. That misses, 1-2. Ready to deliver the one and two. Late making contact on that swing and will do it again on one and two. To third. Taken in by Carpenter. Throw gets him. Two down. Matt Duffy gets his first chance here. Looking to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. And a strike called at the knees. Nothing in one. Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Grichik giving chase. And that's the third out. Matt Carpenter is into the box as we are all leading set to the begin the third. And guys, this is the guy you Matt want leading off Carpenter. this inning. He's your leadoff man, so maybe he can One get up. things started. Set the table for a little bit of a rally. Samarja so getting up, and that'll move the count to one and one. One and two. One and two. Now a swing and a miss as he picks up another one. Make it four strikeouts already, and there's your first out. Now batting. Number, Number 41, 41 steps in now. Fastball misses in the dirt as he tried to get him to chase the low one. Now a swing, and the barrel of the bat breaks in two that time. But this is a foul ball. Swing and a miss, and it's a ball and two strikes here. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. First baseman, number seven. Matt Holliday stands in looking to put the bat on the ball for a change here with the first two guys going down on strikes to start the inning. He'll hold off on the slider to start the at-bat. It's ball one. Takes this the other way to right. Pence is there, and he'll put it away to retire the side. Leading off the inning, Brandon Crawford, as they'll Leading look to get something giant. going here and even this game up. Brandon. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1-0. and Hard liner towards short. And taken in out there for the first out. Jeff Samarja will get his first opportunity now. Into the windup and the pitch. In there, strike one. And he gets him to swing through that one. He's in control 0-2. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. And here's a ball in the air now carrying a bit out toward right center. Under this one is Grichik, and there are two away now. 
at the plate, Angel Pagan, as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. And the 34-year-old veteran looks at a called strike. It's 0-1. Yeah, he wasn't showing bunt there, but even with two outs, you can't let your guard down defensively. Bases are empty here with two men out. Chop foul at the plate, and he stays alive, still 0-2. Off speed pitch ball, in the strike, dirt yeah. as he takes it for a ball. He pulls this one into right. Piscotti is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Stephen Piscotti is ready here as we begin the top of the fourth. Samarja is ready. Here's the first pitch. And he'll start the inning with a pitch that misses off the plate. It's ball one. Hit high in the air down the right field line. And this will be handled by Pence for the first out. Striding into the box, Rendell Gritcher. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. In the air to straightaway right. Moving under it, Pence. And he makes the catch for the second out. At the plate, Yadier Molina. He flew out in his last at bat. Here's the first pitch to him. Right there for strike one. Three runs, three hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. And indeed it will. He throws him out at first, and the side is retired. So it's back to the top of the order now. And standing fourth is the left-handed hitting Denard Spann. Number two. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And he watches a called strike at the knees. No balls and two strikes. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Piscotti is there. One down. Stepping up to the plate, Second Joe base, Pennant. He one. singled his last time up. The fellas, that's Pennant. still their only hit in the game so far. They've been pretty well shut down. And a high strike there, 0-1. This guy has been amazing. He's thrown a first pitch strike to around 80% of the batters he faced. And we're in the middle innings now, so you know he's doing well. Hot shot to third. Carpenter has it. Throw gets him. Two down. Buster Posey will dig in. The winner of last year's Silver Slugger Award for National League Catchers. And a called strike down in the zone. Nothing in one. Oh, can't spot the cutter any better than that. Nothing in two now. And you kind of get the sense that he's not really messing around out there too much. There hasn't been a whole lot of setting guys up here in this inning. He's just trying to get himself back into that dugout as fast as he can. Protecting on 0-2, so we'll do it again. The next 0-2 misses, and that'll move it to 1-2 and two now. And now on 1-2, and two, this might be a... And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and... Colton Wong heads for the box to start off the fifth in this one. Samarja into the windup. Here comes the first pitch. Now a bunt attempt here. Uh, this gets foul. It's 0-1. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. I think that's been his best pitch so far in this game. Guys just haven't been all that close to him. And this is going to be a foul ball. Oh, and he dusted him now, off the plate that time. Some mind games being played now. It's one and two. On the ground to the right side. Throw won't be in time as he reaches it first. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. Now a move over to first. And a dive, but he's back in. Why not? Make him get dirty. And again a throw and a dive, but he's back. 
Just keeping an eye on him. Yet another check on first. And he'll get back in safely. First pitch of the at-bat. Number 36 stands in as he looks at ball one here. And right about now, you got to know as a hitter that you're going to see a heavy dose of that splitter. That's a good take up there to get ahead. Fastball at 96 on the radar gun, and it's one and one. Runners on the move for second. Pitch outside the throw. Way late, and he's in there easily at second. Three runs, four hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. Trying to bunt here, but this winds up hitting him. And they're going to say that he went after it. A strange strike, too. And this misses, so that'll fill the count at three and two. And he misses there for ball four. So runners are at first and second now with nobody out. The pitcher, the pitcher Michael Walker. Steps Michael up to the plate in a Walker. sacrifice situation. So let's see if that is indeed oh, on right here. And the slider bounces, and that'll get on by. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. Gets on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Set to deliver on nothing and two. Here it comes. One ball, two strikes. Slider. Good two strike pitch, but it misses one and two. To two balls and two strikes now. Cutter and it doesn't make it back. Three and two. Well, we see this all the time. Guys get up 0 oh and 2, and they start getting cute, and then they wind up walking the guy. Shatters the bat as this is hit on the ground. Belt over to his left. And indeed, he'll take only the out at first as the run comes in to score. Matt Carpenter gets a shot here as he'll look to pick up the second run of the inning now from third base. And you know, he doesn't really have to do that much right here. With one out, there's a ton of different ways for him to drive that guy in. And that misses for ball one. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2-0. Outside, 3-0 now. Three ball, no strike. Here it is on 3-0. and And a good comeback there. It's 3-1. and And he misses with one here. It's ball four. So that'll at least bring the double play into the conversation with runners at the corners and one away. First pitch on its way. Runners blanking for the plate. Squeeze attempt misses. And they will tag him out in a rundown. And that is Bonehead City right there. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And this gets right through him, and that may be a run. He'll come home with it. Oh, and Span comes up with a big throw there. He's out at home play. Leading off the inning, Hunter Pence. And they'll need him to Leading get something the going Giants. here. Boy, they've got some right work to Taylor. do here, but there's still a Hunter. lot of time left Pence. in this game. So just chip away, chip Three. away. And he gets ahead here with the fastball. Strike one. hit hard towards center and that's a base hit so the pressure's on to open up the inning Brandon Belt stands oh, in he's crazy. 0 for 1 after grounding out and now with the double play in order they'll obviously be looking to induce another ground ball out of him right here went about halfway there but it's a called strike regardless this is pulled into right and that's a fair ball as it'll head toward the scoreboard and now they'll have runners at the corners to start off the inning. Matt Duffy is into the box for his second appearance. 0 for 1 with a fly out. And I'm sure he'd like a base hit right now here of any sort. But hey, another fly ball wouldn't be all that bad. Because he should be able to drive in a run with a sacrifice fly. That's over, but low, it's a ball and a strike. 
two and one. Runners are at first and third with none out. He's fallen behind now, three and one. With two on already, sooner or later, you got to come in with something. And the more pitches he throws, the more likely it is that this guy's going to be sitting on it. And they take him out of the zone here, and he obliges. Not the greatest of swings there for the first out. And here's ball four on the intentional pass as that'll now load the bases here and set up the force at the plate. Low with a fastball. here in the dirt even it's ball one yeah even though you've got a big lead you don't want to give him a cheapie that's a nice block right there that's inside and a hair low it's two, two balls, balls and two strikes look out don't want to hit him there it's full three and two grounded to the right he's got it the second for one onto the pitcher covering and he dropped the baseball Angel Pagan digs in, and we'll see what he can do here with two on and two out here in the fifth. A couple of ducks on the pond out there looking to make that trip home. This is a big two-out A-B right here, guys. Now a 58-foot curveball that misses for a ball. Hit out towards second, taken in by Wong. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Corey Guerin will get the call here as he'll start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 62. Matt Holliday will dig in now. He struck out and lined out in his first two at-bats. Yeah, he hit that ball pretty hard on the line out. He just couldn't get it to fall for him. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. Chop fouled over towards the coaching box. Sinker is right there for a called strike two. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Stephen Piscotti strides into the box now. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. Here's a called strike about thigh high. Nothing in one. towards second throw in time at first for route number two Rendell Gritchick will stand in now he struck out and flied out 0 for 2 thus far swing and a liner but this will be foul the 0 1 pitch a softly hit ball here, foul off to the left side, and it's strike two now. The 0 2 home. And here's a sinker that causes him to back away as that just about got him. The 1 2 offering looked like a slider that time, but it's 2 and 2. Here's the pitch on 2 and 2. High in the air and deep to left center field. Span looks up. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. The batter number four, catcher, Yadier. So a solo shot here to left center field as they stretch the lead to 5-1. Now some action out in the Giants' bullpen as they'll have both the left-hander and the right-hander get loose. That's taken. Now it's 0-2. Swing and a soft liner. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Denard Spann, and they'll need him to get something going here. Center fielder. Seared down the first baseline, but a foul ball here, 0-1. Swing and a hard hit ball down the line in right. Solid base hit for him, his first of the afternoon. The throw into second, not in time, and he's in there with a double. Joe Panis will dig in here, one for two. He's singled and grounded out so far. Yeah, putting the ball in play, sometimes that's half the battle. A 
And now the Cardinals get the bullpen working here. Both the lefty and a right-hander have stood up. A swinging bunt out in front of the plate. Molina is up with it. Throw to first is in time for the first out. Stepping in, Buster Posey. He got called out on strikes his last time through. And he'll try to crowd him there to start the at-bat. It's 1-0. and Now a fastball for a called strike. It's 1-1. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Oh, with every pitch it misses, he just keeps digging himself a deeper and deeper hole. And that misses ball four. So with one out, that'll at least set up the double play possibility here that could get them out of the inning. Hunter Pence comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Swing and a little tapper. That winds up foul for the second strike. Breaking ball. That's in the dirt as he takes a ball. Skied into straightaway right. Piscotti is there. Two down. Brandon Belt will dig in. One for two. He grounded out the first time and followed that with a base hit in his second plate appearance. Waka comes set. Here it comes. Fastball in there for a called strike. And this catches the zone as well. It's 0-2 now. Inside as that perhaps will back him off a bit. 1-2. Fought off at the plate and we'll do it again. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. Number 64 is on, and he'll take over on the mound. Number Colton Wong steps in, working on a one-for-two game so far. Leading off for the card, And he'll power in a fastball that time at 94 for strike one. Swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. In under the hands with a fastball, it's one and two. Able to protect the plate with two strikes, and he'll see another one. Grounded to short. Crawford's got it. And a close play at first, but a great stretch that time as they get him by a step for out number one. But hold on here now. He jumped out of that dugout in a hurry. He might ask for that out call to be reviewed. Well, I think we're going to have to wait and see what the word from the dugout is. But here's one more look at it. Man, that's tough to tell if he was out for sure from that angle. And I can see why this was a really tough call on the umpire. So here's the signal from the bench, and they will indeed ask for the play to be reviewed. So the umpires will get on the horn with the replay operations center in Manhattan and attempt to get a definitive answer on this play. Standing in now, number 36. And here's a ball hit in the air. On the move is Pence. He makes the running play. Two down. Michael Walker will stand in again. A couple of ground outs for him on the ledger in his two trips so far. Yeah, just sort of rolling over on it, guys. See if he can make a small adjustment and get through one here. A fastball off the plate away. It's ball one. Here's his swing and just foul, says the umpire, and he was right on that one. Down the first baseline. Belt has it, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Leading off the inning, Matt Duffy, and they'll need him to get something going here. Well, you're facing a pretty big deficit in this game, so they need to start clawing their way back. 
slapped hard the opposite way. But this is right at him in right field as he hardly has to move to take it in for the first down. Brandon Crawford steps into the box. Let's see if they avoid the zone again or try to challenge him here. And he'll take strike one on the fastball, registering at 93 that time. And he lays off for ball one. Ripped on the ground to first. And he'll take this to the bag himself, and there are two away now. Kelby Tomlinson will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 37, Kelby Tomlinson. And a high strike to begin the at-bat. It's 0-1. And it's quickly 0-2. Filthy change up that time, but he's able to make contact and he'll get another chance. A little late on the fastball, but he's able to spoil that one off and he'll get another chance. And here's a ball hit in the air. Holiday ranging into shallow right and that retires the side. Josh Osich will be summoned from the bullpen now as he'll take over to start inning number eight. Matt Carpenter stands in, reached on a walk in his last trip. In there at the knees, strike one. Big swing and a miss at the fastball, and he's behind in the count 0-2. Well, he'll lean pretty heavily on that fastball. Why not? It's a big one. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back here. It's 1-2. and two. And he'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at 2-2. Two and two. And that one never threatened the zone. It's gone full now to 3-2. and two. Pulled toward right center field. On the move is Span. Looks it into his glove, and there's one gone. Number 41 will bat Number down 41. two for three in the ballgame. Yeah, he's been solid at the plate for his team. One of the better performers in their lineup, I'd say. There's a strike at the knees, 0-1. Chopped foul right at home plate. And this is swung on and missed. Two are quickly retired to start inning number eight. First base Matt Holliday will stand in now, and he's been kept quiet out of the number three hole, hitless in his three at bats so far. And a reach, but it's by him as he couldn't quite get to that ball. Stephen Piscotti strides into the box now, launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. He's set, here it comes. There's a good fastball on the outside corner as he'll take a look at strike one. And he falls behind 0-2. Swing and a miss. Blew the fastball right by him in the Angel Pagan will step in. He's lined out and grounded out in two trips. He seems to be seeing the ball okay, though. Making some decent contact so far. A little bouncer, but it's foul strike one. Fastball called for strike two. Time to be alert for signs of tiring here in the eighth. He's a pitch away from 100. That's lifted the other way out to left. Oh, and he misses it for third. And he is in there. Denard Spann will dig in. He doubled his last time. Boy, he had a great at-bat last time up, and he'll look for another pitch he can drive right here. And they start him out away with a cold strike. That's in there, and he's deep in the hole now, 0-2. Breaking pitch, and this bounces in front of the catcher. 
hit hard on the ground to second. Wong is there, and this will be an RBI as the run comes in to score from third. Joe Kennett digs in with one run in and one gone in the inning. Waka gets the sign. Here's the first pitch. Outside target here, and he hits it for strike one. A little quick on that swing, and he finds himself behind 0-2. Can't get him to chase. It's one and two. Line towards center field. And that's in for his second hit of the afternoon. Buster Posey steps in with one in, one out, and one on here in the inning. So a new pitcher coming on now, and the call's gone out for the big guy, right-hander Jonathan Broxton. He's ready. Here's the 0-1. This is in the air out to right. Piscotti has a read on it. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Hunter Pence will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Here comes the first pitch. Righty against righty as this is taken for a ball. It's 1-0. Pitch to the plate is a slider for a strike, and it's all knotted up at 1-1. One and one tap foul at home plate. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one two hit high and deep out to left center field. Grichik ranging back. Now a leaping effort at the wall but he comes up empty. This one is gone. Home run. So a two-run home run off the bat of Hunter Pence. As they pull within one here, it's now a 5-4 game. Brandon Belt is at the plate as he watches ball one. That evens it up, one and one. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. That's going to even up the count at two and two. Straight three called as he can't get the bat off his shoulders. Side retired. Striding in to start the ninth, Rendell Gritcher as they'll look for some added insurance before the bottom half of the inning. Ninth inning begins as the first pitch is taken for ball one. Runs outside, so it goes to 2 0 now. Swing and a miss, 2 and 1. Chopped weakly to the left. To his left, Duffy. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. Yadier Molina strides in, grounded out his last time through. And a cut fastball in there for a strike. It's 0-1. That's over, but low. It's a ball and a strike. Here's the 1-1. And he'll fall behind now to 1-2. and two. Grounded back up the middle. Backhanded. Throw on to first. Two gone. Colton Wong. Ready for another at bat now. He's two for three so far. Yeah, and you can bet he'd love to get himself that third hit. Those are the kind of games that puts a little extra pep in your step. Two out, nobody on. A swinging bunt to the mound. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Leading off the inning, Matt Duffy, as they'll look to get something Leading going here and even this game up. And so far in this ballgame, he hasn't even been on base yet, so we'll see if he can make an adjustment here. And here's a fastball called for strike one. 
Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Around first on his way to second now. And he'll get in at second base as the tying runs aboard with a leadoff double. So stepping in, Brandon Crawford, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. In there, no balls and a strike. High and deep to left center field. Grichik racing back. Gone! Santa Maria, game over! So a two-run shot to left center, and none bigger than that one as this ball game is over. Our final line score tonight, first for the victorious...